South by Southwest organizers say the festival is still on for this month, despite a petition calling for it to be canceled. And now some tech leaders want to brainstorm ways to make it safer for those who attend. Keg Sands' Jacqueline Powell is live for us outside the convention center downtown. Jacqueline. Sydney, that petition that we told you about to cancel South by Southwest just keeps on gaining momentum. Right now, more than 24,000 people have signed it. And tech leaders here in Austin tell me that even though South by is still scheduled to go on as planned as of right now, it's creating some fear among the tech community, too. As South by venues like the Capitol Factory plan to move forward with the festival. <sighs> okay. okay, so this is one proposal. Yeah. <laughs> Planners are thinking of everything, all the way down to replacing the handshake. People, a lot of people are talking about the foot tap. You go, boom. And it's something you can do both. You go, boom. Because that is one of the major transmission methods, and it's 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 really difficult and socially awkward not to shake hands. So we need to be intentional about addressing that and come up with the the, the official South by not handshake. Capital Factory CEO Joshua Baer is leading the charge in creating signage to promote that and other health messages at the festival. He says tech leaders are working closely with Austin Public Health and hopes that the festival will go on safely as planned. Companies in Austin have invested in order to make those hundreds of millions of dollars that come back. They've spent probably more than $100 million getting ready for South by Southwest. Twitter CEO Jack Dorsey already announced he's canceling his speaking engagement. Other companies like Amazon, which has scheduled sessions at South by, have announced travel restrictions for employees, saying they'll avoid all non-essential travel within the U.S. Which I don't know exactly how you define that or what that means. And others, you know, are choosing not to travel at all. You know, obviously each company needs to decide what's right for them. Well, the Capitol Factory is hosting a town hall called Hack Coronavirus this Friday. We're told that tech in, the tech industry will be there with health and policy experts trying to come up with the best ways to make South By as safe as possible. Some of the ideas they're already throwing out there would be infrared cameras that can monitor whether people have fevers and also having nurses on site at events. Live in Austin, Jacqueline Powell, KXAN News.